As the COVID-19 pandemic has upended the healthcare system, the economy, and our everyday lives, NBC News asked readers to share their anonymous stories of social distancing, self-isolation, and quarantine. These are your confessions. My CEO thinks social distancing is for social gatherings. As if the virus knows the difference. Hashtag still working on site. I'm the one hoarding toilet paper. Asked to go on a first date right before social distancing started. Our only date option is to go hiking six feet apart. I don't have enough work to do at home to justify my pay. I realize how much we as humans need this face-to-face connection with each other, and that shouldn't be replaced with our screens. I'm disabled and typically homebound. It's the rest of you in my family who are finally learning how I have lived isolated for years. Isolated on my homestead 23 miles from town in rural North Dakota. I feel like Laura Ingalls Wilder in Little House on the Prairie. Making do. All work is done bottomless. My job sent me a big box of personal protective equipment with no N95 masks. I'm a nurse practitioner in public health. They might as well have slapped me across the face. I'm 30 years old with no immune system. My boss told me yesterday, people just gotta die. We can't sacrifice the economy. I wanted to cry. To see more confessions and to share your own, go to nbcnews.com slash coronavirus confessions. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.